Hey everybody, my name is John Anthony Chihak Soltero. I am the anti-hero, and I'm also the creator of the Bubba Patrol. And right now we're running a crowdfunding campaign on Indiegogo. The link's going to be down in the description, so please be sure to check out the campaign. And I'm here to tell you a little bit about what's in store with the Bubba Patrol campaign. First of all, we're on issue four, and um, uh, it's just the Bubbas are getting ready to go on their first mission. And so it's very, very exciting to know that there's been this buildup to actually seeing the dogs suit up in their costumes for the very first time, the entire team getting ready to go and help make a difference in Apex City. Um, as usual, there's a lot of wonderful dialogue in this. Um, there's a couple of throwbacks to past issues as well. Lots of Easter eggs and some ad lib dialogue as well. Um, one of the pages, I'd already lettered everything and I could have sworn I lettered something specifically on a certain page. And when I looked back at it, it wasn't on there. And I can't recall if it was actually in the, um, in the script or not, but it was always in my head to do, so I added it in today. Um, there's a couple of fine tuning things that we have to do, like adding in a few advertisements. Um, and that's where you guys come in, the crowdfunding element of this. And you might say to yourself, well, didn't you run a Facebook crowdfunding campaign a little while ago? And yes, we did. And yes, it was an extremely successful campaign, which we're very, very thankful for. But a couple of things have happened between then and now. One of those things is the printing partnership program that I was using through Alterna Comics has been put on hiatus. They haven't given a real definitive time frame of when it might be coming back because they themselves don't know. Um, all we do know is that the printer themselves was having trouble meeting deadlines and meeting expectations of that partnership program. So Alterna Comics, in their infinite wisdom, did decide to put it on hiatus instead of just stacking more things on there. So I had to search for a different printer. I found one. The issue is it's more expensive, of course. But everything kind of is right now during the pandemic. It's all at a premium, these services. So that's why we've got to do this Indiegogo campaign. But... There's some really cool stuff that's coming with the Indiegogo campaign. So first of all, we've got a Vic Hollins variant for issue four. It's going to be an Indiegogo exclusive. Uh, it's going to be limited to 30 total printed copies. And just like with the Foley Forever uh, variant by Bill Simpson, which is also limited to 30 total copies, I previously... Last weekend, I made up some certificates of authenticity. So when you buy this, this edition, when you get this cover, you're going to get the COA. That's going to be numbered just like the copy of the book that you get. So you know it's authentic. Um, and then at the same time, we've got the Bubba Club coming back. So you can get a lifetime membership to the Bubba Club, which is going to include a mini print. It's going to include a button new membership cards, an intro letter, and a few more things uh, added in as well. Also, we finally, I was finally able to figure this out. I couldn't do it last time. I don't know why. Got the add-ons mixed in just right. So if you're backing a specific portion of the campaign, whether it's the regular basic Bubba's, just issue four, if you're getting a rebarked, if you're getting the... Um, uh, the Vic Hollins variant, and you miss something in the back, but you but you only need the bubble files, you can add that on. If you need the special edition with one and two, you can add that on. If you want to add the entire set, you can add it on for just cover price. There's a lot of crowdfunding campaigns out there, and I don't fault them for this. If you do the back issues, sometimes it's a little bit more expensive. Not doing that. In fact, if you want to get the issue three Vic Hollins variant, it's actually less than what we're selling it for, like on the non-con show or when I go to conventions. Instead of 10 bucks, you're gonna get it for seven on this campaign only. There's some really, really sweet retailer tiers as well, including advertisements in the book for just 50 bucks a piece, 
One of those has already been claimed. What does that come with? You get a full page ad. You do have to create that yourself. Now, you don't have to be a comic book resale shop yourself. If you're running a YouTube channel, if you are running a Facebook channel, if you have some sort of service that you are providing that is gonna be all ages or family friendly, you can definitely be a part of this and have a full page ad. Again, you do have to create the ad yourself. If you need me to create it, there's gonna be an additional charge, especially because we'd have to get it done in time for printing. Um, each of the retailer tiers is coming with at least seven copies of issue number four. But here's the cool thing. I went back and I changed all the retailer tiers so that you're also getting the retailer back issue packs. Now that's the special edition, that's the bubble files, and that's issue three. The seven pack for the retailers, you get a three pack. The 12 pack, which comes with a retailer incentive cover, a one in 10 cover of Guri in her space dog costume, also comes with a couple of back issue packs, just because we want to get you to be able to um, have plenty of stuff to be able to sell. And it gives you more of a value and an incentive to pick these up. We've got a retailer exclusive cover. That's the big whole shebang thing. It is, um, you get your own exclusive cover. You get 25 copies of that cover. You're also going to get 30 copies of the Bubba Patrol issue for a cover. You're going to get three uh, Space Dog retailer incentive variants. You're also going to get one blank cover. You're going to get one Vic Hollins variant, and you will get one Fully Forever variant. Here's the kicker. You're also going to get 10 retailer back issue packs. So that's adding 120 bucks onto that because it's $12 retail for the back issues. And the biggest part of this is you do get to keep the original 11 by 17 artwork that's created by me. Every single tier that's in here includes shipping. So if you're wanting to add stuff on, add stuff on. It's not going to add to the shipping cost. Um, we are only shipping to the continental United States because anything outside that shipping is going to be crazy. However, if you're outside of the United States and you do want to work with me on shipping, let me know. I will do so. Um, but the shipping is going to be a lot more. So whatever you order, I'm hoping that's going to be worth it to you for, for either your collection or for... Um, for your retail shop. Um, again, if you're running a YouTube channel, if you've got an, uh, an Instagram channel that you're running stuff off of, you can always run an ad with us. We, we definitely encourage that. And if you have read the book in the past, whether you're a retailer or a collector, please, please, please send any questions, comments, fan notes, whatever you want to do to BubbaTales at gmail.com. Tales is T-A-L-E-S, play on words. BubbaTales at gmail.com. Be happy to print your fan art, your fan letters, or your questions in future issues of the Bubba Patrol. But once again, um, I do thank you so much for watching the video. Please check out the link below. That's gonna be the Indiegogo campaign. We've got over 20 days left. We do have the option to extend the campaign if we're starting to see like all kinds of crazy life and people picking stuff up and asking for us to uh, extend the campaign. So definitely consider that. And if you can't do that, please just share the campaign. If you've read the book in the past and you've already picked something up from us for issue four, let somebody you know like about it. The Bubba Patrol makes a wonderful gift for somebody who loves comic books or even somebody who's not so sure about comic books because the Bubba Patrol is everything that's good about comics. Because the Bubba Patrol proves it's not the size of the dog, it's the size of the dog's heart. And these pups 
powered by hope. Thank you. We'll see you at the end of the campaign trail.